in this video you will learn why uh you basically have to buy the rumor sell the news and why the okx listing and any other exchange listing for saitama will be the end of saitama we'll check out how listing uh the binance listing affected chiba because everyone's like the listing getting listed on exchanges is a good thing no it's providing exit liquidity for whales uh there are also paying the marketing teams and influencers to promote the tokens and very likely the exchanges because they have a fee make no mistake they have a fee and you're paying that fee by pumping the token before that we'll go over all of this but before we start look all you have to do is hit the like button really really helps out the channel you also want to subscribe and try and hit 50,000 subscribers and i'm planning to be the biggest crypto youtuber in the stratosphere by saying the truth what i think about tokens not just hyping you up for uh, some meme coins there are some meme coins i like and this is the and there is a right time to buy meme coins and there is a right time to actually sell them keep in mind that the video is no financial advice. i'm just a random dude on the internet if you want to buy saitama though you can buy it on mxc exchange i'm sponsored by them and you can win a tesla if you trade futures on mxc uh so i'll start off by just showing you some of the good news Good news is voting results for popular meme token projects. Basically, it's an OKX listing, but I'll show you because you need to hear every word that I'll say right now. Thanks for the participation of community users. OKX special voting event for seven meme tokens project has ended. The result of voting are hereby announced as follows. Based on the deposit voting from community, the top four projects are Saitama Inu, Miu Inu, Shiba Predator, and Pitbull. All massive tokens. Massive. With massive utility. Basically all dog tokens. Uh, spot trading for Saitama opens at, on the March 29th. I'll probably cover that. That's tomorrow. And yeah, for some it was... Yeah, pretty much everything will happen tomorrow. Everyone is excited nicely done everyone's happy which and there's nothing wrong with that right the community is, is strong there people are happy about it on reddit it has 5 billion trade volume and it was the first shiba called listing and then it 30x what this is great but how big is this okay yes okay so it has 5 billion trade volume and it was first coin shiba gold listed on and then it 30x yeah but when it got listed on binance it ended are we losing a zero by the way shibino got 30x not because of the okx about because of the ox uh okay okx listing it was because of elon musk elon musk in the beginning of the meme community with dogecoin pumping and people looking for the next doge now they're looking for the next shiba and there's a lot of people that want to communicate that a lot of tokens that want to communicate that message i think this is kucoin Let's keep the positivity going, both back. We're on the way. And yes, we are pumping right now. But there are a few dangers we'll talk about within the chart right now. Uh, and they're very big. I'll actually use trading view to show them to you. But the first thing I want to show you, because you might be thinking that getting listed on exchange is a good thing. And I would understand that. So we'll go ahead uh, and go to the weekly chart to just show you how bad an exchange listing can hurt a token this is the week shiba inu got listed on finance it was the 10th ish of may here you can see that right here may the 10th it was announced on finance check what happened after that from the top to the bottom how much did the price drop so starting from here uh, i will go ahead and try to find the bottom and I love I love Shiba Inu by the way. I'm just saying, you know, factually back testing how can a listing help a token. Well, this is how it helped it. A 90% drop. This is what we got. So <laughs> what can we expect for Saitama? Well, let's open up the chart right here. We'll start off with the one hour time frame. And we want to see what is the price doing right now. Uh, let me fire up some indicators because I want to see the uh, 
No, I don't care about sonar lab. I care about the probability power indicator. Uh, I want to see price targets. We're already having some bearish momentum, by the way, right here. Right here. The targets on the bullish side are here, 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 and here. These are the targets. I'll mark them up. If you're still bullish on Saitama, there's nothing wrong. Here are the price targets. We had one that was reached. That's good. The second might be reached. I would expect something like this, by the way. Here and here, because this is a major resistance area. The, the, the top resistance were on an institutional level were broken. It was the 11,972 area. We broke past that by 12, 13%. What I would imagine happening in the next few days is a big pump to here and then a drop after the exchange listing. Because uh, Wells will, will at last, like where, how can you cash big, big bucks? Well, the only way to do that is actually, is actually here. Is actually dumping at the right time. And this would be the right time. So that would be perfect for Wales to dump on you. Um, but yeah, listings do not help as much as you would think they do. They just don't. They just do not. And to be honest, Wales probably bought here on the 27th, at the beginning of yesterday. Probably bought here. This is why we had this huge spike up. And now here, they're already in profit. If we pump here, they're already in profit. The people buying along the way are the people that will lose the most out of this situation. There's an overwhelming amount of positivity around Saitama right now. Nothing bad with that. This is the wolf pack. Congratulations, Saitama wolf pack. You did it. We hit 5,000 wallets on FKX exchange. This is crypto and this is how we roll. Uh, yeah, kapow. Oh, that's the Will Smith. Price of sight, the reality, there's can says, can it be right? Yeah. So yeah, people are happy about it. There were some mistakes made along the way with Saitama, but there were some good stuff. Issues with fees. I do not know if people care care that much about it. In general, people are happy on YouTube. Massive gains, one hour, Saitama addicted. By the way, this is probably a robot speaking. Louis the leader. That's not a robot. That's actually a cool dude. I think I watched one of his videos. Uh, yeah, this guy makes videos just like mine, by the way. Exposing projects. Um, Saitama is now six feet under. Let's go. I think he made a few shorts. I saw he make a few videos. Experiment will continue to lie to you. Why make XR, XRP videos? Yeah. He does shorts, basically. Will win, Ripple. He's getting uh good. Yeah, he, he he's probably on TikTok, right? Jeremy. Can I find his TikTok? Twitter link tree. Jeremy, let me know your your TikTok. I like your style. Because, yeah, it's really hard to make it on YouTube if you want to speak the truth. It's easier to just pump tokens. People will just give you a like to uh, to help them pump their tokens. And that's there's nothing wrong with that. But, again, there's in my opinion, there's the right time to buy a token. And there's the wrong time to buy a token. <laughs> now it's too late for Saitama. It might have been good five days ago. It might have been good a year ago uh, before any pump. But it's definitely a time to get out, in my opinion. Let me know your thoughts and decisions in the comment section below. See you next one. Bye.